What's going on guys? Today I want to talk a little bit more in depth and how I did this Pelican lid setup. I got a ton of questions in the last video, so getting right into it. If you missed the video, this is my smaller size Pelican that always comes with me to the range. It has an assortment of Microbat Systems candy pouches, as you can see, a Ferro Concepts turnover, a triple shingle, and a knife from Doughboy Blades. So, as you guys can probably hear, the whole lid, I guess, of this thing is fully Velcro lined. I will leave the guy's Instagram down below who cut me the Velcro to do this. Uh, it wasn't cut exactly, so it's not like a precise thing. I kind of just, you know, threw it together. I just bought the Velcro off him, but he's a really good resource if you want to do something similar to this because he gets some pretty interesting Velcro options from Velcro themselves. He doesn't just get what you find at your local fabric store. He can actually get a little bit heavier duty stuff and a lot larger stuff. If you go to the fabric store, you're pretty much going to be limited to what they have. And it's usually some inch and a half, two inch wide strip. And it's going to cost you a bajillion dollars to get enough to fill the whole lid of the Pelican. He really hooked it up for me and he was able to get some larger pieces of Velcro. As you can see here, I have a three inch wide or so section as well as like a four or five inch wide section on this side but really all i did to do this was remove the foam heat up the glue evenly spread the glue that was left over on the top of the case just as kind of a test to see if it would help the velcro stick and it really does so i heated up a section spread the glue evenly cut my strip for the corners here and then applied them, then heated up these middle kind of supports, spread the glue, applied this piece, and then same for the middle two, and then the other side. No issues with the Velcro peeling up. This Velcro is a pretty hefty duty uh, series. Uh, if you guys didn't know, Velcro does make different strength of Velcro. This is one of the heavier duty ones. So even the heaviest stuff I have in here does not peel off and it does not flop around. All this stuff, uh, once it's applied, is pretty much there until you pull it off. It is definitely not easy to get some of this stuff off, but that's why I did it. If you guys have any other questions or you want to see anything else on this setup, leave it down below. As always, thank you guys for watching and thank you for all the support.